Right. Great addition to our team this year has been Stephanie Odie. She takes care of our uh, player interviews at midweek. She's got a great one this week as we bring in uh, Stephanie. Uh, take it away back in the studio. Yeah, Clay, it was certainly an interesting conversation. I talked to Harry Miller, the freshman center. It was his first time addressing the media this week, but he certainly did not disappoint. So many interesting stories with him. And this week I'm taking you inside the huddle as he talks with me about getting more playing time and a unique extracurricular activity that he enjoys and may want to take to the next level. Well, Harry, you set a career high this past weekend in career minutes. How does it feel to get that playing time? It feels really good. Um, really, I just want to kind of make our ones proud, make Coach Stud proud because he has a lot of trust to place us in there. Um, and, you know, Chugs and Gunner get in there and they have to trust us as well. So it's, it's a huge experience and um, I'm really happy to get it. Some big news broke for you guys. Chase Young is coming back. What was the initial reaction in having him back? It was a great reaction. I was very happy. He's fantastic. You know, I think one of the best players in the country, and that's the argument if, that he is the best player in the country. And so it's fantastic to get that news. Very excited. I was talking to Athletic Communications Director Jerry Amick. He had so many stories to share about you. The man of many talents. You even said you were considering minoring in music. I hear you play the cello, the harmonica, the piano. There's a Facebook group going on oh, really? with all of your music music oh, yeah. so have you what kind of music are you playing these days um i've really been into the beatles recently i've been getting into the beatles eleanor rigby eleanor rigby's kind of been my new project on the piano all the lonely people mom and dad i'm trying to get a cello for christmas so if i could get a cello for christmas that'd be really good so i could practice with nick and um it's and i have talked with luke farrell as well who plays the drums and is very talented you mentioned nick and some other teammates should we expect a buckeye band That's in the near I'm future that's what I'm expecting. I don't want to, I don't want to uh, make any rumors, but I'm expecting to drop an album soon. I'll have to get in the production studio and see what I can do. You heard it here first, guys. Football fever. There's going to be a new Buckeye band That's in town. The hope. That's the hope. All right. Well, thank you so much, Harry. Absolutely. Best of luck this Absolutely. weekend. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, Harry was so much fun to talk to you guys. He was actually valid Victorian, so well-spoken, and he goes to Nicaragua every single summer, and that was actually very important in, in the recruiting process for him. Ohio State gave him that availability, but he was saying that when he was going and going through the recruiting class trips and things like that, he said that he wanted to take his time and really think about what university he wanted to go to. Well, he said that a mentor that he met at Nicaragua was from Dayton, an Ohio guy. He said, you got to go check out Ohio state and when he got there he told his mom he said i could get struck by lightning if i don't sign today and so right. that's how he knew uh -huh. that this was his university and he was going to be a buckeye no, no, made the right decision. Cool. i just want to know you know is, is there room for a couple of washed up guys in yeah. that band because i, I want to be, be the lead singer of the band okay, yeah. well, relax I said, uh, we'll, I could, we'll, we'll co lead singer. i'll do the vocals oh, okay you you stand behind the drum guy yeah there you go it's play trombone back in the day yeah. maybe yeah. i'll bring that along somebody get just a trombone to add to the cello i would love to see if anybody actually buys tickets to that but hey <laughs> and of course, oh, today's so today's game will no doubt be a homecoming for several Buckeyes today. They are returning to the Garden State for this one. One of those players.